Welcome in. Just a quick video on printing maps in Caltopo. Feature that maybe a few haven't realized is there, but is wonderful to have. I have pulled up Caltopo here in an area in Kentucky, somewhat close to me. It's called Cave Run Lake, and it defaults to Map Builder Topo. And up here in the top right, you can see that I am not logged in. So you can do this with the free version of CalTopo. I am going to change the base layer to Forest Service White, because I think that will show up better on the screen here. So down here is a um, Longbow Marina. This is where we input. And this is where I do a lot of kayaking back up in this area. If I wanted to print off a map of this area and take with me, and I do, I can hit print. I can hit my scale, put it on 1 to 24,000, bring that over. I can put my UTM lines on, my grid system that I use. And then if I generate PDF, it will come out and generate one PDF map, one to 24,000 scale, gives me my declination, overlays my UTM grid, uh, a thousand meter grid system here. And you can use it. It's a standard one to 24,000, used it all my life. However, if I wanted to produce maps that was a little more detail, kind of zoomed in, I could come in here to my scale, say custom, uh, let's say 6,000. I can bring that where I'm going to input, get it set up. And then over here on the left side, this green here, I can add page and it produces another print screen. And I can overlap them just a little bit. I can add another page here. Let's say that if I want page three to be landscaped, I can do that. And I always like to overlap just a little bit. Just like that. Let's see if we can add one more. This is usually about as far as we go. Swimming. Up. There's a little good place to swim up here. Right there. Now that I've got it all laid out, I'm going to generate four pieces of paper. One big map divided into four uh, sections. It's going to be one to 6,000. I'm going to go ahead and generate the PDF. Now, the more pages you have, the longer it's going to take to generate, but it usually does it within a minute or two. So now it not only generates the four pages of the map, but it gives you a control map up here as well. Control page. It shows you where each page is laid out and how it's laid out. If we scroll through, you can see that it just gives you much more detail, ability to see especially as you get older and you can't see the detail in the contour lines zooming in at this one to six thousand allows me to see some finer detail in these contour lines so if i was trying to find a place to pull over for lunch to swim to camp um, if i was trying to meet somebody uh, we'd be able to see much more detail whatever the case may be there's page one page two Page three, remember it was in landscape mode, so just flip around. Tells you that it's page three down here. And then page four was back to portrait, so flip it all the way back around. And then if I hit print, I can print in color or black and white. But close this out. This comes in handy, say for instance, if you're doing a kayaking trip down a river, covering many miles, if you're doing multi-day hikes, comes in handy uh, let's say that you're doing the um, the AT Appalachian Trail something like that you can print these off have a backup to your GPS phone and such and again I am not logged in so this is free version here that you can do and not have to pay for a subscription it is wonderful check it out hope that helps till next time be safe